है एवरी वन वेलकम बैक टू आवर न्यू वीडियो इन टूडेज वीडियो यू विल लर्न व्हाट सोइल प्रोफाइल मीन्स एंड व्हाट आर डिफरेंट ओराइजन और लेयर्स ऑन सोइल प्रोफाइल जस्ट टू वॉच दिस वीडियो टिल द एंड बिफोर स्टार्टिंग प्लीज लाइक दिस वीडियो एंड सब्सक्राइब टू दिस चैनल फॉर मोर हेल्पफुल वीडियोज अ सोइल प्रोफाइल इज अ वर्टिकल क्रॉस सेक्शन और लेयरिंग ऑफ द सोइल दैट रिवल्स इट्स डिफरेंट ओराइजन और लेयर्स Each horizon has distinct characteristics, properties, and composition, and together they form a soil profile. Soil profiles are commonly studied by soil scientists, agronomists, and geologists to understand the soil structures, composition, and fertility. The main horizons or layers of soil typically found in a soil profiles are here. There are six different layers of soil profile. To make it easy to understand, you need to know their short codes. Do you want to know their abbreviated form? Probably your answer might be yes. So, here we go. The short form of six distinct profiles that are known worldwide are O, A, E, B, C, and finally R. Let's learn them deeply. O horizon. It is also known as the organic layer. This is the uppermost layer consist mainly of organic material such as decomposed leaves, plant residues and other organic matter. It is rich in nutrients and is the layer where most plant roots are concentrated. This layer is found in forest areas. In this horizon we can see the active microbial activities and hence the soil for this reason is used for growing seedlings a horizon it is also known as the topsoil layer of the cultivated land this layer is essential for plant growth and contains a mix of minerals organic material and living organisms it is often darker in color due to the accumulation of organic matter and rich in nutrients and this reason is more preferred among farmers e horizon this layer is also known as the lichinger alluvation horizon it is characterized by the loss of minerals and the nutrients through leaching it is commonly lighter in color and may be present in some soil profiles this reason is mostly found in forest areas you may have a question where do the least minerals go Is there any stoppage of minerals lost from E horizon? If such questions are roaming on your mind, then you will get the answer on B horizon. B horizon. It is also known as a subsoil or alluvial horizon. This is the layer where all the least minerals are deposited. This accumulates minerals and nutrients leached down from above layers. It often contains minerals that have been transported from the above layers. giving it a different composition than the top soil this layer is crucial for plant nutrient availability c horizon this layer is also known as a parent material layer this is the layer that represents the unconsolidated material from which the soil has developed it is less affected by soil forming process and serves as the source of mineral content for the upper horizons R horizon it is also known as the bedrock layer and this is the deepest layer of the soil profile this is the unweathered rock below the sea horizon the solid base of the earth this layer lies beneath the soil profile in some cases the soil directly overlies the bedrock while in others it may be deeply overweathered each of these horizons contribute to the overall soil profile and the arrangement and characteristics of this horizon provide valuable information about the soil's fertility drainage composition and suitability of various land uses soil profiles are often depicted graphically in soil profile diagrams we saw the vertical distribution of this horizon in a specific location if you found this video helpful please like this video and subscribe to this channel for more informative videos And if you have any questions please let me know in the comment section below